Good morning everybody and welcome to my humble abode again. Today I would like to build the diesel generator. So let's go straight down to the workshop and see what we need to do that. So I've got this book here the diesel generator this is biodiesel power minimum so it's a diesel generator so the diesel generator is another multi-block structure and here we need generator blocks and radiator blocks and it's again it's a it's a five by three structure by three high and it's fairly straightforward so we need radiators and generators so let's make sure we've got those built already if not and we also need a lot of um, heavy engineering blocks and I've got 28 already made so the small version of the um, I didn't show you this by the way the last time oh, wrong one. So here I actually put some covers uh, on top of the a pipe and the pipe this is just an item that, that comes out of the back of this cyclic assembler and comes into this chest and it's hidden with a cover. The covers are on um, the same mod, it's a thermodynamics cover. Stone cover thermodynamics. Makes it look quite smart. Right, so what we need are some radiator blocks. Here's a radiator block. So for that we need copper and steel and buckets of water so let's put a bucket of water in the middle copper I've got plenty of here and we need in total um, nine radiator blocks this makes two so we want five basically so steel I need to go and get I've been cooking steel actually all the previous episode I've got 51 may or may not be sufficient but this is run out and here we've got 30. We'll see. Okay, so steel. Let's put this into two. Sure enough. So that will give me exactly one. Because I have to replace the, uh, the water bucket, so I'm never going to get too many. Now we have sufficient heavy engineering blocks, sufficient radiator blocks, and the next one we have to generate uh, make of the is the generator block, and that's this one here. So for that we need kinetic dynamos. So uh, with six steel and two electrum ingots. Okay, electrum is very easy to make. It's just ground gold and silver. So you just like gold and silver you mix that together like this and you get electrum the grit you just cook the electrum grit and then you'll get electrum ingots so I've got plenty of electrum ingots the steel we need and we also need kinetic dynamos I made those previously the recipe for this is very straightforward it's just a copper wire coil which is um, just copper wire around one iron ingot and that's very straightforward just four copper ingots around stick and that makes four so two of those will make one copper wire coil and that will make one kinetic dino, so you need eight basically. And I think we, we need six of these in total, good yes we do. So the generator block, let's have a look. Oh, actually I only need three of these don't I because we only need six generators. Right, that's sufficient generators. I've got extra, it doesn't really matter too much. It's not the end of the world. So, now we need to lay this down. And of course, we need the fuel, so move the torch out of the way, put the torch over here. So, this is the fuel from the, um, the refinery. And that can go directly into the into the diesel engine. So let's make 
start here and start putting down engineering heavy engineering blocks so it was a pattern of engineering blocks let's just move these other items out of the way don't need those straight away and the radiator will be the front here so let's put the radiator down next and at the back we'll have a generator we only need six of these so we can do it like that and then we need yes that's fine Oops, missed. Let's just remove that one, I think. One wrong place here, so how do I get rid of that? Okay. And that should make... Um, the diesel generator. Let's have a look. Sometimes it takes a few seconds. Did I hit that? Did I get the recipe right? Let's check the book again. So we've got radiator blocks, yes. Heavy engineering, yes. And de and generator blocks, correct. Next level. Oh, so I went two to two. Next level's the same, yes, did that. And the last level is these. I don't think the direction matters. Hopefully not. So that looks correct. Right click it with a hammer. Oh. Yeah. I had to click the front here. And look, one huge diesel generator. And we can take the fuel, I think this is the fuel input here, so let's take this tank out of here now. Let's also move this torch out of the way. And actually while well, I'm here I'll take away these two tanks. So, what I think we need to do is to run some pipe between here and here, and that should supply the diesel with power. Let's have a look. Of course, I don't have any pipe. I've got one pipe with me at the moment, which is. Ah, oh, there should be some in one of these chests, I think. Let's put this in that chest. I turn the chest around. Ha! How do I turn it around? It's on the top? Yes. Okay, I'll try not to use that. Do I have any pipes in here? No. Okay, so I'll go upstairs and get some more quickly. The workshop. And we just want some ordinary pipes for that. Impulse ducts. Actually, I should have some somewhere. I wonder. Have I got them in here? No. Have I got them in the knapsack? No. Hmm. Alright, we've got hardened, we'll take some hardened with us. Four, well, this should be sufficient. And I don't think I need a servo. But just in case I do, I will take one. Otherwise, I'm coming back again, aren't I? This is quite a room now, isn't it? So, oh, okay, that was easy. Oops, I don't want to do that, do I? Let's move those out of the way. on it to see what's going on see if it's got fuel or anything I think stand 
concealer. I think this here is a power. Ah, here we have a look. Here are the outputs from the side here, and here is a, is a place where you can put a lever. Let's put a lever down there first of all. The lever will turn it on or off. I think I could have built this the other way around. I suppose. That's, is that working? No. Or if it is, I don't know. Yes, it is. I'm not completely sure about this diesel. Let's have a look. Maybe it takes time. Oh, what happened to the fuel there? It all got absorbed. So maybe that is working. So what I have to do now, of course, is to remove these connections here. We don't want connections everywhere. Simply right-clicking. And I think... Well... Hard to know, isn't it? If it's actually working or not. I would expect smoke to come out of there. Yeah. Okay. Well, I think what I'll have to do for this time. It's a huge machine now, but I don't know what I'm going to do with the power. It's going to produce what? Um, 4096 RF per tick, which is 20 times more than the nuclear reactor on the top there. But it does need a lot of fuel, according to the to the book. Okay. I hope that you enjoyed that and until next time, bye for now.